Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level three in the second stage of the Rainbow Rapids adventure. In this one, we need to collect five of these rainbow jello molds in 25 moves. Okay, so this is a bit trickier. We've got one, two, and three layer thick frosting here, but then five layer thick frosting here. If you're not used to the new frosting, let me explain. The white background is one layer, and then every stripe adds another layer. So this is one stripe, so that's one for the background and then two. This is one, two, three, and then we know that there's still a background here, so it's one, two, three, four, five. And so we've got a lot to get through. We've got these ribbons, but the ribbons, those are easy. If I snap one of these, since these are all connected, they'll all go. And if I take this out first and these combine with these, then all of this would go if I just remove one of these. So that's something that I could try for. What I'm going to do, ooh, look at this. I can make a color bomb. What I'm going to do is try my best just to clear all of this out and not worry about the sides for now. Now look at this. Here are where these uh, rainbows are going to come from, and we can see a little bit of a border here. So this is going to come up this way and then go in and fill this mold. This one will take the outside track and fill this mold. Same thing over on this side opposite, and then this one comes straight down here. But I want to clear out the center. Now it wants me to put these purple together. Not a bad move. But if I just take out the blue, then I can put these purple together. And to me, that's a better move. It's really hard to see some of these uh, patterns, but the more you play, the, the more practiced your eye becomes. I miss them all the time. It's sometimes really obvious ones. Now, I don't think I'm going to have much success in getting these together. I could just take out a color right now and concentrate things down, but I'm just going to try and see if I can get something better than what was there. No, not really. So what I'm going to do is take out all purple from the board, and now... Oh, these never fall into position. Well, that's something good to know. I thought maybe those would kind of slide down. But they are... I don't know why I thought that. There's no conveyor belt to move them. Sometimes they will move if they're on a conveyor. This looks like a good move for me, and this is an awesome opportunity. Before I take it, I'm going to make this move. I know that means I'm risking this. I do understand the consequences that may befall me. I could even make more moves over here, but I don't want to risk it too much. I just thought having another wrapped candy on the board would be really beneficial. Because those wrapped candies, they'll help us to reach down here uh, more quickly than we could do it without. All right, so here's a wrapped candy, but I'd love to reposition it if I could. Hmm. As a matter of fact, I'm going to do this and see if I can get some cascading to help. Okay, so I could make another stripe, but this is only one layer and I've got a stripe here. I'm going to do this and reposition things. There we go. And now this is ready, but I've got frosting to get through. I was trying to make a stripe draft combo. Didn't quite work. Oh, well, hold on. We got another one. Now, should I go for the stripe draft or should I turn it into a raft draft? Well, if I make this, things could blow up, so it's not a guarantee. And the striped wrapped would hit a lot of stuff. Hmm. Or I could just make the stripe go, and it would bring the wrapped candy down. It wouldn't help over here as much, but it would help here more. I'm going to make it all equal. I'm going to try to help both sides of the board by doing this. And this is looking good so far. There we go. We've got that beautiful stripe right there. Well, now it's right there, and now it's not quite so beautiful. <laughs> but look at this. I'm liking that right there. Look at all that fun stuff. Now, this is still multi-layered, but it's kind of getting cleared out right as we go here. And then we get a little bit of a, a boost. I've got another striped wrapped combo that would take out one layer, but I'm just going to hit this directly while I can. And then I think this will do it. It hits once as it goes horizontally, once as it goes vertically. So I made a lot of specials on the board, 
that I didn't even need to use, but they were there in case I needed them. In case I didn't have a direct route, I could take an indirect approach. So that is it for me for this level. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.